So Jamie, do you know any football related apps that I can download for all my latest news? There can be only one. There can be only one. One what? There can be only one football. Oh aye. A football app that brings the latest news and in-match updates to football fans all over the world. Is that right aye? There's got to be a catch. There's no catch. Pick a team. Any team. One football covers over a hundred leagues and competitions in incomparable detail. So make sure you download One Football. To ensure you get a great result. I've been using One Football for now about six months. It's my go-to app for whenever I need to find out a score in any match I've got on my coupon. I genuinely couldn't think of any better way to get ahead of your rivals. The link to download is at the top of the description, so please go check that out and you can potentially win some prizes in the run up to Christmas in the new advent calendar. Is that all good, director? Yeah. Right, cheers. G99 out the third part tunnel. Diving. And the referee was out of order. We should have won that game. I'm, I'm, I'm offended. I'm shocked. I'm switching that ass. No, no, keep it on. That's scandalous. Shocking. It's outrageous. Hey guys, Gogsy here and welcome to episode 165 of Running the Grounds. Now, if you saw my last video, you will know that I've got a speech impediment. So I'm going to limit my speech today as much as I can because literally my tongue's swollen. So yeah, anyway, third time lucky today. Hopefully we can get something at Celtic Park, that'd be great. Getting the 1004 train. Uh, going via Motherwell because I've got to get tickets for Tyne Castle next week and yeah, then we're going to the game. Motherwell! We got a photo featured because uh, we had the no diving sign on Wednesday. Not taking one today because that doesn't work. We're in Motherwell now because I've got to get tickets for next week. Also, the last time Motherwell played at Celtic Park in December, we won 2 1. So I'm hopeful today, but I'm not expecting much. It's really annoying when you've got a swollen tongue. <laughs> tickets been bought, time to go and get to the game now.
obviously the expression is hard, but anyway, tell them it's so much better. I mean, you see how bad I've been swagging us off, but just remember, we got a point off them on Wednesday, that's, what, that's what's important. I mean, I'm just going with the logic. If they can score twice in the first half, we can score twice in the second half. But I don't think we're going to win. But oh well. Brian was saying that we did absolutely brutal. Back at Mullow now, the words can't describe how terrible I'm feeling. <laughs> I can't describe how terrible I'm feeling. I can't even speak. So I've finished, I've drowned my sorrows. I might actually be sounding a bit more normal now. Uh, but gotta thank Stevie again. It's always a pleasure. We're going via McDonald's on the way to the train station. I'm struggling to walk straight, but oh well. We got, we got scunnered 5-1 today. I think I deserve a drink. In my eyes, it doesn't matter if you get pumped. As long as you end the night on a high. Now, pronto, rapid stream. Time is like 20 past midnight. I need my bed. Yeah, cool, we got beat. Uh, I'd actually rather be lost 5-1 in a cup final than lose the way we did in the cup final. But, I can't have it from my own way. Hopefully my tongue's repairing. To be fair, I was expecting that there's always at least one game each season where Celtic just absolutely thrash us. Hopefully that's it over and done with. New page. We're not going to let one result at Parkhead justify our season. Uh, we're just going to go again at Tin Castle next week. And yeah, there we guys. I'll see you later. Take care. Couldn't even be bothered with a match report. This don't feel the same. Take me back to your love. I never said.